Hi everybody, it's Jazz, a okay, trend trader for you. So every week what I do is um, I look at the spy charts, the weekly and the daily, and I do a little bit of analysis, you know, uh, pointing out uh, the trend, pointing out the support and resistance, and try to give a uh, little nuggets here and there. However, this week um, I'm still going to talk about the spy, but I'm going to do uh, something different, which is to compare a professional platform with the non-professional one. And I'll go over the little bit of differences between those two uh, so that it can help uh, more likely the beginners or the novice the traders that are the people basically want to get into trading. So this obviously this presentation or this video is going to be focused on uh, the beginners, the novice or maybe uh, to some extent the intermediate traders. OK, so let's get started on looking at these uh, two uh, uh, professional uh, one's professional and one's a non-professional platform so what you're looking at is a uh, thinkorswim right now okay thinkorswim is by td ameritrade uh, one of the uh, the most professional platforms out there okay there's a bunch of them there's trade station there's e-trade uh, there's uh, fidelity uh, there's few others third-party ones that you can uh, you know sign up for but i'm going to just show you a simple one which is a uh, Again, non-professional, freestocks.com, okay? You can still do quite a bit of analysis on this one, and you can totally do to full extent on this one, okay? So let's talk about the, the freestocks.com, right? Obviously, it's free, right? The reason why it's uh, almost perfect for the novice or the beginners is it offers all the tools that you need in a professional okay and I'll talk about the tools that you really need okay you don't need a whole lot of uh, extra tools but in order for you to become a you know, chartist or beginner chartist or even to an intermediate level you can definitely use these kind of platform there's another one tradingview.com uh, stockcharts.com but I prefer the free stock chart .com only because uh, it's user friendly I've been using for a while and um, it does have a little bit of lag for the intraday charts, but not a whole lot of lag, okay? So just simple looking at this, right? All this, all the platforms, okay, they offer a chart. Charting is basically what is a charting software, right? You can change the time frames from here, okay? You can look at the weekly uh, chart. Basically, each candlestick in here is, a, let me just do this. Each candlestick in here is a weekly candlestick. Then you have a daily candlestick, right? And it also has the ability uh, that your professional uh, platform offers which is to add studies okay so if you click on here add indicator you can add all the studies in there I'm not gonna go into you know, talking about the particular studies but I'm showing you what this offers and uh, over what professional ones offers right then you can also um, uh, change the settings of the chart itself you can change the way it looks so you can change from the, the candlestick to lines to a bar chart you can put alerts in there from here you can actually even post on the Facebook uh, uh, from right from this one you can take an image of it you can save an image whatever you want to do and you can also to some extent uh, make a watch list in here you can make your own watch list in here right I have uh, used it you know many many times uh, earlier and as you can see I have created this watch list international ETFs and very you know very user friendly you can also have the little bit of news in there too so th these are the little features on it you know the price change the symbol the volume etc etc so this is probably one of the best ones out there as far as uh, uh, live data that comes you know intraday wise and you can also have these little tools in there too if you want to draw a trend line you can draw a little trend line in there with this tool okay if you want to write the text on it you can write uh, you know, the text the text on it right you can draw a horizontal line on it you can draw an arrow on it you can draw a rectangle on it whatever you need to do it, it offers a lot of you know really nice features okay but so it all depends on your trading style okay so if you're a beginner you're not going to jump in and start trading day trading right you're not going to get in a stock that you're going to be buying today and selling today you're probably going to be doing a lot of research on it you're probably going to be starting out as a fundamental trader and believing in a company or its fundamentals and then buying the stock based on some kind of you know I don't know some kind of a financial institutional service that you might uh, uh, buy or 
whatever it is, how, however you're doing it. But you can always uh, just go on here, make up your own account, okay? And um, save up your watch list or whatever you want to do. So that is what your basic platform would look like, okay? The basic free star, uh, uh, charting software will look like. So let's look at the professional one now, okay? So that those are the features of the free stock, charts.com. So professional, I'm using my paper account in here. Uh, in this one, it's you can get really complicated in it, okay? Very complex features in there where you can save a lot of data. And every time you reopen it, you'll have all the drawings or all the studies that were built into your um, scanners or whatever it is that you need, okay? Uh, a lot of people, when they're um, or if they're new, they when they hear the term, it's a professional platform, they tend to walk away from it because they're like, oh, it's too complicated for me. It's really not complicated, okay? It's all about just getting to know the system. Once once you have good feeling about this, a little bit of even feeling about the um, the software, how it works, all you need to do is give a little bit time to it and repetition after repetition. That's what's, that's what's going to make you a novice trader to intermediate to even a professional level, okay? Everything is really simple on it, and I'll show you, give you a few... Um, of the features background on it okay so same as that okay you can type in your symbol in here let's just say Facebook right you can type in uh, spy you can go back and forth whatever you want to do you can draw your trend lines in there every uh, professional uh, platform they will offer almost similar tools okay for instance you can go into the drawings and you can draw a trend line all you got to do is select the trend line okay click one button okay and click this okay that's all you gotta do click here and click here you draw a trend line as simple as that you go into drawing tool you want to do a little bit of a uh, if you want to draw a horizontal line just double click on the chart it gives you a horizontal line right and many many other features in it right not gonna go into detail of it draw a rectangle arrow text you know uh, you can do all these other tools in there just like the other one this one also have if you right click on it You'll see many, many studies, and in fact, uh, a lot more studies than uh, you could get out of a um, uh, more than out of a um, the free uh, software, right? Which you can definitely uh, uh, get them into uh, these studies. You can, uh, based on these studies, you can build this build a scan that can you know scan all the stocks based on your criteria. Okay. Also, you can make a watch list in here. You can create basically. Uh, let's just say create watch list okay test type in here SBY okay bye simple as that okay you can name yours my watch list save right there that's your watch list. you keep on adding your stocks into it how simple is that it's pretty simple so don't get a you know a discouraged by when someone intimidated by when somebody always oh, a professional platform they're all the same, okay? It's not a, it's not a rocket science. You can easily understand. All you gotta do is put a little bit of time in there, put a little bit of a you know effort in there, repetition. Because I'm gonna definitely gonna make you um, even a better you know a trader from uh, a beginner to intermediate. Okay, so another tab in here is something called news, live news. Every stock that you type in here, or let's just say um, Apple, you're gonna get all the news pertaining to that uh, symbol that you typed here you can link it right you can see you can have m multiple charts in here and you can unlink them you can link them you can have five different charts and you can all link them to blue meaning you can watch the same chart in different time frames weekly daily hourly five minute whatever you want to do all you have to just click on here and link it or unlink it simple as that and then you have your news which is linked also to the uh, uh, the ticker or the symbol that you're typing in here okay so that is your uh, news button then you have not going to go into details of these but you have a lot more so for instance level two is your advanced feature which you're not going to get in the most of the uh, free softwares right and you probably won't get a time and sales feature which is your um, ordering history in here okay now you won't probably get this in the free um, software. Then you have other tabs in here where you can now literally trade off of Active Trader. is a it's kind of like a depth of the market dome. They say it. you can actually place orders right on top of it here. Okay. 
one of the nice features about uh, uh, professionals is you can build your own studies okay for instance if you go into studies okay you can have a you want to build your own study or edit study or whatever you want to do you can uh, build all these studies and built into it on right on top of the chart and uh, I don't have any built in this program but I have it on my uh, professional one the one that I use uh, not the paper account where I have built mul multiple studies to scan for stocks to scan for stocks that are under tense to scan for stocks that are oversold scan for stocks uh, that that their earnings are coming out right so there's a bunch of different studies that you can build in the professional platform which is the biggest uh, uh, probably one of the biggest advantages of uh, these professional platforms and you can save them all you gotta do is click on it and if you go in here you'll see all these different um, you know uh, stocks that you can search for long ETFs okay you can have all the ETF futures whatever you want to do it'll search for you can build your own studies and they'll all appear in um, in this section okay one of these as uh, they're um, abbreviated based on their alphabets right another feature is that uh, you can use the patterns tab on it okay if you want to search for some kind of pattern on there you can look for all these descending triangle channel up channel down ascending head and shoulder all you gotta do is select and apply and if there is and you can actually apply a few of them okay if you say add selected okay add selected apply and then you want if there's if the pattern appears in the chart it will show you that pattern in the chart um, let's see if it apply maybe must not be a pattern in the chart but these are the studies that you can build based on you can look for candlestick patterns you can look for you know any kind of a uh, uh, pattern that you can define in a study okay so that's why you can see that comparing your non-professional one which works similar way but you have less le less of a features in there but it's exactly the same you know it's not rocket science to understand these once you make one once you have your own professional platform you just gotta learn it okay every platform offers a help feature you just gotta go and you know look at the tutorials and see what they talk about and if you have any problems in the customer to customer rep or whatever if this one actually have a live support all you gotta do is click on it and you, you can get a live support where you can simply ask the question and you'll, you'll get an answer pretty quick okay so that is one of the other features uh, of the professional ones is and uh, they all very different prices some have a uh, higher commission fees some have a uh, monthly fees but if you are just starting out something like this is totally fine but you still need something to place your trades right maybe third party or various non-professional platform meaning uh, where it doesn't have the charting software built into uh, for instance some of the software like fidelity they might not have the charting software on the other side your e-trade they have both the um, charting and their uh, regular um, website kind of a order entry system too so those were the differences between your professional and your uh, non-professional of course there are a lot more features that you have to once you sign up once you sign up with whatever you sign up with you'll find out but you have to take the step you have to take the initiative of learning all these different uh, tools that they offer so ending let's talk a little bit about a look at that do you remember that pattern select we we selected it uh, selected some patterns pendant and a flag so you're getting all these okay don't just completely trade off of them okay always uh, do your own research don't trade off of the studies don't trade off of a uh, you know just because you know something is uh, saying oversold always 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 do your homework right so let's look at the spiral quick okay Let's like this so the reason why there was nothing to talk about in here is because we are almost making highs okay we're actually broke out of here we talked about this in our chat room where spy was still strong okay broke out of if you look at uh, we'll look look that uh, in a daily ch pattern to daily chart too but see how you had it a uh, really nice uh, bottoming tails they wanted to push the prices up so let's see if we actually um, keep on going higher and keep on making higher highs and higher lows otherwise there's no resistance there's a little probably support uh, to the bottom side of it uh, but I'm not gonna go into too detail uh, this time okay 
your daily chart uh, again higher highs higher lows and just just pretty uh, it's been trading in this very choppy uh, you know price action just sideways you know all from all the way down here right many many weeks it's just been sideways so probably uh, we could see a nice move to the upside and maybe start a some sort of a trend we'll have to keep an eye on if there's any kind of weakness or any kind of uh, pullbacks to from that weakness in a decent uh, support area other than that this that's all it is and uh, let me just quickly write my email in here info at trend trader for you okay and so that's my email if you have any questions about any of the stuff we talked about today feel free to shoot me an email and and also if you'd like to just uh, come check out uh, in our uh, chat room for right now there's one week of free trial going on feel free to you know just email me and say you know what I wanted to check out your uh, chat room and the what, what we do in it we do pre-market analysis of the mostly the spy then look at a bunch of other charts and we also look at the gappers or the gap uppers gap downers and we frequently we have a teaching session uh, within the chat room hours that way we're, we're not just trading we're also learning at the same time too and we talk about everything we talk about uh, futures to stocks and uh, we talk about um, you know a lot of educational stuff uh, in the slow times and a lot of the trades are coming off of all the education stuff that we talk about so you know, log in there and see what if it uh, if it's something that you want to learn okay if it's something that you want to pursue as far as even as a uh, trading too because we have a lot of trades that we throw out um, other than that I'll talk to you guys later take care and have